back to the next adventure here at Kid DM. Calvin, are you ready? Yeah! Are you going to take it easy on them this time? No! <laughs> Let's see what happened on our last adventure. People have been having like really bad nightmares. We've been drawn here to help, I think, right? Mm -hmm. Not about the nightmares. Oh. oh! It's something far worse. A sacred froggy dance instructional video. <gasps> the Swamp City Dance Competition is next week! No! <laughs> You're telling me that this dance video has been stolen and we've got to go get it from the jungle swamp forest? Oh, so my dad's going to uh, put out some items for our quest and we can kind of divide these up to whoever you want, but my dad will explain them. This is a glove of transformation. <gasps> oh, and there's the, the Fisher distraction. The kittens pounce on the fish. Yes. <laughs> so that has three charges of fireball. Each of those balls you can pl pluck off and throw them and they become fireballs. Whoa. <laughs> Do not release that unless you really need it. In there is the most terrifying ghost we've ever seen in the world. Tonight, we're just going to go to bed before we leave in the morning. At night time, you to do a con check. Eleven? You're having a nightmare, by Ooh. the way. Everyone else, roll perception. Oh, okay. okay. Not twenty. You notice something slithering in the night. You can see some black smoke coming through Tyler's forehead. Well, like he, like he's, he's sucking the black dust out of me. Alarm! Alarm! Yeah. Uh, I feel you squirming. Listen to me. <laughs> what with the black smoke? It's gonna use some suggestion. Okay, I got a four. Leave this frog village and me alone. Thank you for your time. <laughs> I appreciate everything you've done for me. Uh, your cheeks are very soft. And uh, have a good day. You know what, guys? I think I actually got everything I needed from this. So uh, <laughs> I'm going to go. Yeah, I'm going to follow her because... Uh, and, yeah. <laughs> sure I'm just going to leave. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. go. I just... Are they going to go into the forest? Next? Oh yeah. Eventually, you all come across a detective sheet. <laughs> so I was like, do you know where the video is? <laughs> oh, I think we need to speak sheep. For perhaps there's a swamp dialect I won't understand, but I can at least try. So she can speak with animals. We are looking for uh, a missing tape. Well, that's my specialty. Do you have any suspects? There was a Yanti, and, and Alice will describe the Yanti that they had that encounter with. There's just a temple very close to here. Oh? Yeah, Snake Temple. See some of those snakes coming in out of that. You know what mystery I'm solving right now? Oh, please do tell. The mystery of some sheep dying. Young green dragon oh. comes over that sheep. What? And read some poison. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh. Uh, as well as you. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, man, I think we found out who's killing the sheep. <gasps> okay, well, we're back. I'm Calvin's dad. This is Calvin the DM. And Calvin, what did you just throw at them? A green dragon. Yeah, Calvin's got his uh, 12 d6 right here. You have to roll a constitution. Save okay. 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 34 damage. Whoa! Oh, three. 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 Poison. Three. <laughs> Is it just poison damage or do we also or do they also get the poison condition? It, it's just poison damage. Right. Okay, just poison damage. Got and if you, uh, if you made it, you take half. And that was the surprise action. <laughs> <laughs> it was. That was the surprise uh, action, but uh, up now is, is Miranda Moonlight. Uh, okay, uh, what do I want to do here? I was not expecting this. How does the detective look? Don't worry, I'm a level 20 detective. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try to do enlarge reduce on the dragon. Mm. And reduce the dragon. Yeah. <laughs> you you got to do a con save for me. Come on down to our own size. That's low, yeah. Okay. <gasps> no, it's a reverse growth sport. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to pay for that. <laughs> you know, a little crack in his voice, that's awesome. Detective Wool, what's your name? Sherlock. Sherlock, of course, it's such a good name. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, I shrunk him down. I think this might be your problem. Hmm, I'll take that as a suspect. <laughs> well, <laughs> this green dragon is the most terrifying thing I've seen in my entire life. So You'll see more terrifying stuff on this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when he realizes he's covered in 
in this poison vomit from a green dragon. He says, oh, uh, 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 this seems rather um, pleasant. Uh, and then um, decides to start telling the story of... We're fighting, bro. We're not telling stories. <laughs> yeah, but this is how I fight. So that's an action. And my bonus action, um, a uh, um, the little water spirit uh, begins to float towards the dragon, getting within uh, 10 feet of it. The tentacles yeah, slap, bonus action, I slap the yeah. dragon. So it's a 24 to hit? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it takes eight cold damage. Uh, and its movement is reduced by 10 feet. Yes. Sir, Hoppy. Sir Hoppy pulls out his Vorpal Greatsword and he runs towards the dragon. So much bigger than yours. And hey. as, as he gets closer, he puts so the big sword big. away and says, I don't even need it. I use my karate! Oh, he does, and he does two points of damage on this dragon. <laughs> yeah. It looks more annoyed than hurt. Yeah. <laughs> great, 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 great. Take that, you smaller dragon. Uh, the young green dragon is up. He's just gonna claw oh, the closest sir, hobby, you're in trouble. He's got his karate. Whoa. Nat 20 Ooh. on Sir Hoppy. Uh, 20 damage to Sir Hoppy, and he just backhands Sir Hoppy out of his way. Gets slapped really far back. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa. He's flying. Woo! Oh, no! And Tyler Swole is going to take one of the beads from his fireball necklace, uh -oh. and he's going to throw it at the dragon. Um, and as it travels through the air, it turns into one of those medicine balls that you see at the gym, <laughs> and it just gets bigger and bigger and bigger, and then hopefully hits the dragon. Ooh, he saves. It barely so gets. Ooh, okay. It's half damage. Oh, he takes half damage. Yeah, okay, yeah. so half damage from the fireball. Get those d6s ready. 26 Ooh. is the damage, so half of that would be 13 points of fire damage. Miranda's like, this is making me, my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, you're not vomiting enough. My stomach is hurting quite bad. One second. Uh, so I'm gonna go. Uh, oh, there's a puddle over here, and hide behind the sheet. For <laughs> <laughs> and then come back out. And then, and then. No, Miranda, don't. <laughs> Are you going to see more? Oh, no. <laughs> Ballista's here. It's Ballista. Hey, I'm gonna attack the dragon. All right, let's get it nice and flat. Nice clean spin. <laughs> Blowing it for luck. Okay. <laughs> so you start getting very small. I uh, know. Oh very small and getting wings. I mean, I'm not as British. Well as oh. turning to like a bird and getting a tail. Huh. Uh. Oh. Eventually, you transform into this. Oh! oh. <laughs> I'm a cockatrice. Ballista, you have something about oh. your mouth. <laughs> Miranda, you should come back out here. Melissa's got a problem. <laughs> she had a crystal great sword, but now she's a chicken. Now she's a chicken. Uh, I'm gonna look at the the dragon. I'm gonna do it. Uh, yeah, I do. But I'm gonna look at the dragon and be like, Mama. <laughs> <laughs> the dragon act actually is like. Very confused. <laughs> Does the cockatrice like go behind a tree and then come out wearing glasses? And they're like, Where did my baby go? He <laughs> just gets so confused that he just flies away. <laughs> well, there's still the sheep. Oh yeah, the sheep says, "Well, but we should. I'll go investigate that dragon more." Uh, but uh, you got yes, I, I a deal's a deal. You and I, the temple is just due north, uh, but be careful. No one's ever been there. So you have arrived at the temple. Uh, there are two snake guards in front. Forgot! 
I'm just seeing here. <laughs> why don't you do uh, a, a perception check? Oh, well, I got a nat 20, but I am a Ooh. cockatrice. So you guys see the cockatrice 12. pick up a, a book with her. <laughs> <laughs> with, <laughs> what did you do? My tie. Uh, uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, I'll begin to sort of. So you, you realize that this th- the diary belonging to the leader of these snake people. <gasps> Larry. 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 <laughs> Larry. Their leader. Checks out. Yeah. Evil name. He Larry. he yeah. he was the best snake dancer. Larry. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Larry? Yeah. <sighs> he is the best dancer. And uh, do you remember my father talking about all those uh, deaths and uh, distributions? Uh, Larry's doing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, oh, one moment. She can't speak with animals. Maybe we can hold this over Larry's head to get our tape back. Yes. It's probably something embarrassing in a diary. Oh, let me check. Uh, yeah, I'm going to look for something embarrassing to Larry in this diary. There are a few things. Okay. And while you're searching for that, you also notice a page that says his plan succeeded. Do you want to read more about that? Yes, absolutely. If I see that a plan succeeded, I want to yeah. know about that plan. So his, he says his plan to steal the Froggy Dance video has succeeded. Well, I believe we have found our suspect. And he also almost has enough nightmare smoke to do something epic. Yeah. It will summon something. It will summon something epic. Deadly. Epically deadly. Oh, God. Something that can kill a Tarrasque. Something epically deadly that can even kill a Tarrasque. I, like, it's there literally... Are so, there are so many ellipses in his writing style. It's hard to read. It's very, it's very snake-like. Yeah. So, so there's two snake guards that are just kind of, like, grumbling, and they're dr- drawing... complaining about their job. Oh, yeah. no. Wait, wait, what are they saying? <laughs> No one's ever gonna come in this temple. We guard it all day. We guard and we guard and we guard. We never do anything. We don't even get paid. I know. What we is only, with that? We only get paid with our lives. Yeah. I, I mean, they told me that at the interview, but I still decided to take the job. But why did you do that? Why did you do it? Oh, you guys need to unionize. <laughs> Oh, Even goodness. if they get in the temple, there's like yeah. one million traps. Yeah, they're never gonna get through this temple. I mean, they're not gonna be, get uh, past the traps one through a five. You know what? I miss Larry. Yeah, Larry's oh. gone now. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Gary yeah. is the new leader. I guess part of the Yanti culture is that you can only ascend to the throne if your name rhymes with the previous king. So yeah. uh, don't forget Gary's, Mary, Mary, right, queen Mary. or queen. There's yeah. Mary. It know. appears like there was some combatants against Gary and Mary, and Gary took over. There's so. also Harry. Uh, <laughs> Harry. There was also kind of like a lower one whose name was Harry, and mm. nobody liked him. Uh, besides being a snake, he was also actually Harry, which is ooh, you know odd. Did we try and get past these guards? <laughs> Ah! Oh, oh. Oh. I'm kidding. I'm back, it's me. Who are we, who, who are we uh, looking Lister. at? Oh, you, oh, see, you guys, we left Miranda back puking in the woods. Oh, you do have her glasses. How do you get Miranda's glasses? <laughs> oh, weird. How would you have her glasses in the middle of the jungle? That is wild. Maybe she's in distress. Oh, oh no. Yeah. She's probably fine. Actually, we should focus on it. So Alice will flounce down the hill. <laughs> Hello. Oh, hello there. Ah, ah, this, uh, who goes oh, there? Oh, no, oh now we have to do our job. <laughs> <laughs> what are you I'm not going to lose here? my life for nothing. Hello. Um. Well, I've heard that this temple is ancient and grand. And, well, I'm here with my friends, and we're tourists in this jungle here. And um, we'd like to just have a tour. Do you do tours? Oh, well, deception check. Deception. That's- Tyler's uh, gonna come out behind her to support her, like looking at a map, being like, oh, "Is this the temple that we were supposed to find?" Yes, dear, it is. <laughs> Alice rolled an eleven on her deception check. That wasn't enough. We, we do not do tours. <laughs> now leave. Oh, um, well, I'd like to uh, resolve this peacefully, you see, because, well, my friends who are with me, they, they, they're not as nice as me. You're gonna die. Wait, why would we die? Yes. Because of the 1,000 traps? There's one, like 1,000? Wow. Yeah, give or take. I, I thought it said steps on the map. No, it, it, now that I'm reading it, it is it's traps. traps. I didn't, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I, no, I, there was a, I got chocolate on it, and I missed uh, uh, no, yes, that's. Uh, we thought it was steps. <laughs> Look, uh, hey man, I'm not trying to die. Uh, you guys, you know, we Fine. can be bought. Fine. 
Just don't blame us when we die. When you die. Yeah, Good. and also pay us off or we'll... Or we'll yeah. What or kind we'll of currency do you guys get paid in now? Our well, lives. Yeah. Oh, so oh. you want, like, more lives? No. We will spare your lives as a form of currency <laughs> if you let us through. <laughs> oh, this is the same thing over and over again. Uh, we also got some extra breakfast bugs. You guys oh, hungry? Yes. We want money. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, so it's like a you classic guys, You guys have, like, any money? Um, oh. I have ten gold. Uh, well, it looks kind of shiny. Maybe boss would like it. Oh, who's your boss? Gary. Uh, Gary? Gary? <gasps> is, is, is Gary like a nice boss? Ixnay on the airy gay stuff. Wait, so Gary is your boss or no? Yeah, Gary's in charge around here and he's going to kick your guys' butts if you go in there. So, but we'll let you in for 10 gold. Look, I didn't want to say it, okay? But we have a very evil ghost in a jar and we are not afraid to use it. It's true. <laughs> His name is Mr. Tickles. Mr. Tickles! <laughs> They, they run they run away. Oh, no. <laughs> wow! I didn't even have to open it. I didn't expect it. That's a, no. Well, he that knows what a reputation can do for you. Bro, I'm pretty good at finding... I can cast a spell that helps us find traps. But okay. if there's like a thousand traps in there, I don't know how we're going to... You know what fixed our problem last time? Mm. I spin this glove, so maybe I should just do that. Yeah, <laughs> okay, maybe we should all spin the glove. Okay, I'm going to do it. Okay. <laughs> You transform into a sword. Whoa! <laughs> a flying sword! A flying sword! <laughs> oh. You transform into a long sword! A long sword! A long sword! Uh, wow! Magnet. Whoa! Why don't you explain this first this long hallway corridor there in this great hall? It's in this, yeah, like he said, a huge hall. And at the very um, end of it, there's a snake statue. A golden one. Okay. It's very gold. Yeah. Very shiny. Now, does he find any traps in this great hall? No. Oh, there's no traps in this great hall. <laughs> okay, guys, there's no I, traps in this first hallway. I don't know who those guys who were talking. They may have been lying about. <laughs> about the number of traps. Yeah, there are four rooms. There's four okay. big iron doors, and then there's a um, an even bigger door at the end of the hallway. But there's the golden snake statues in front of that door. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think Drip's just gonna. Uh, turn into a puddle and try to go underneath the iron door on the first. The first one the on, first on his on left, the right, on, on the right. on the right. Yeah. Okay. There's lots of holes, like uh, this kind of dirt and stone, mm -hmm. massive room. This room is a massive, and it's covered with with lots of holes. And Drip could probably see some what some eyes in some of these holes, Calvin. Yeah. Sir Hoppy is says he wants to stay outside and guard. He, he also wants to make sure if you all die, he can tell the elder what happened. <laughs> so. Okay. It's a good contingency plan. Okay. <laughs> Mr. And as we walk in, you hear Grimmett go, uh, let's just be clear, he's a coward. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he did punch that dragon in the face. <laughs> he's a stupid coward. Oh, okay. I mean, that tracks. <laughs> well, they're not dancing in that room, so I don't know that there's a tape in there that they could be watching mm. and mimicking. So. Please find the VCR player. <laughs> I'm gonna fly. The sword's gonna fly forward and just dink into the um, into the gold statue, trying to move it. Oh, okay. just full ahead. Oh, there is a golden door behind it. Yeah. Can yeah. I get Ooh. to it? Well, what, what would yeah. you notice about the statue that goes uh, over? So. Perception check. Yeah, perception okay. check. You see that its four fangs are missing. <gasps> Uh, I will, yeah, we'll go up to where the sword's dinking into the statue. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dink your front teeth gently. Go. Teeth? Oh. teeth? Let's go, done. And then I'll do it to the statue. I'm trying to indicate. Oh, oh! No, I you think can she... point at the sword. <laughs> I think, okay. I think either she wants me to bite the statue, or that maybe she's pointing at these missing. I'm flying up like an arrow now. Oh. Yeah, oh. she's real. She's. It's her first day as a sword. No, I got it. I'm not judging her. Uh, I think they're missing four t fangs here. I did not see any golden fangs in there, but Drip indicates to me that there are three snake people in the holes in there. Yeah. Uh, well, we could go in there. There might be some, uh, one of the fangs. The sword just flies to... forward and opens the door to the door. <laughs> oh, my oh, God. God. Oh, my Hold on. I would, like, I would like Katie to describe to me how a sword opens a door. <laughs> I, again, just... Dink my head into the door. You pick the lock as, as a sword. Yeah. Just open it. So wait, which 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 room are you going into? The one with the snakes in it? Yeah. Are you going yeah. to the one that Drip went into? Yeah. 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 Oh, so, so that yeah, the so door's not locked. So the so. Because so I keep hearing you wait. say that there's 
eyes in there. And I feel brave as a sword. This is very important. Um, what is the order of you going in this room? I'll go in first because I opened the door. And I will follow after her since Drip is in there and I don't want Drip to be alone. Yep. And then I guess I'll go. And then do you want to bring up the rear? Yes, well, the, the cats are being very slow, but, so yeah. yes. When, but you actually don't ki- don't get in the room. Because <gasps> when three of you are in the room, the snakes drop down from the holes and close the door. <gasps> oh. oh no! And oh. one's blocking it. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching, and we'll see you next time for Kid DM. Right. Don't forget, lots of protein, cut down on the carbs, make sure you get eight hours. And cuddle with kittens. Yeah.